care of your children in a loving way, and you want to bring them up in such a way that they will be useful for the world in future. So then that is also, that becomes a practice. That becomes the bringing up your children becomes a Dharma practice. Marda, Marda. To bring up the children in a way that would be beneficial to the world, uh, to make that kind of intention and working in that way, that itself becomes a Dharma practice. He's not, he thought that I was saying that uh, bringing the children to, to, into the Dharma is Dharma practice. That's, I didn't say that anyway. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so... <laughs> I have some also, doubt. Also, that uh, we have to think kind of, when I say, it, you know, the practice has to be a little bit in an official way or in a formal way, what you mean to say is that um, we have to think, you know, we have to kind of spend some time uh, in purposefully or deliberately thinking and, you know, making our mind uh, kind of concentrate on this, you know. Uh, not just that, you know, it happens uh, on the way or, you know, just, just like that. It's not, uh, we kind of make a deliberate uh, effort uh, to see and feel like that or think like that. Mm. That is important, especially for the beginners, that we deliberately uh, think and, you know, kind of make our aspirations and uh, uh, try to, you know, uh, try to make our mind turn towards that. Uh, that becomes very important to make a kind of, a, a, he's already said, official or formal way of practicing. Mm. Mm. Zawa and if you have family, uh, then you know uh, you have uh, you have love, and that love uh, has has uh, lots of value. Uh, so you know through that you know uh, the feeling of love towards each other. You also bring that kind of uh, love and loving kindness to the whole world. Uh, I told this story before that uh, there was somebody who, uh, who was very, you know, very dearly in love with somebody. And then when... Yeah, it's like an example. Yes. No it's story. an example. Yeah. It is an example that suppose uh, somebody who has a very close, a loving relationship, then when that person even uh, waters the, the flower, uh, there is a certain uh, quality of love in that person's actions of watering the garden. 
Today in Jusan, don't know. The Kajue made the Miru and it was a simple narrow layer and the Tindigi Kajue. Near Sutte to Ajida, similar near Sutte to Ajida. Similarly, she did do what she dug it which had the art. Near Sutte, today in Jusan, I did the gom gap to Zoo Mises and the gom gap to Zoo Mises and the Chogata. Never the Sendigo, the rich hardy. Simba, relax, and little chair, you may. The ladies are teaching Zenadin, Yabato, go yards. Yanaging up on show, listen, Yabato, go yards. I sang Masuriaji, Midian Chong, Yelia, for a sim, sure you are, but sim to the pressure, Mambucha, sim girl. Yaman is sim, she you the trip. Yaman is sim, Gravaji in char. Yanasim Chimacha. Tommy to me, she does several medal, Chamber gave the other duty, Chamber Tower for the other chap. Did she do that? Nearly doing Yamanja from Midua. Did she get that one? Did you dig it? Granted, the man, you know, Miss Sewer Chaperman, simply lose it. Simply lose it, I did it. Miss Sewer to the Sahara, So, this is something very important and which is uh, you cannot do without is that we need to give our mind uh, some rest. And we need to bring uh, kind of uh, peace and uh, joy to our mind. And when we give time uh, to, <clears throat> to meditate or to do certain practices, sadhanas and things like that, uh, that is for that. We are training our mind uh, in bringing uh, peace and rest and relaxation. Uh, otherwise, you know, our mind cannot rest. Our mind, we cannot find peace in our mind. Uh, our mind is too distracted, too turbulent. Uh, it's like, you know, uh, like uh, sick, you know, our mind has fever or cold or something like that. Uh, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't uh, act in the uh, peaceful way uh, without, you know, we deliberately uh, bring that into our mind. So therefore, this kind of training, this kind of uh, formal practices uh, to, to bring our mind uh, a kind of a rest, and uh, peace yeah, is very important. Hmm. It's uh, usually <sighs> we get lots of pressure. Uh, from our work and from our families. We think we have to do this, we have to do that. We are overwhelmed by work. There is so much we think we have to do. So in order to get some relief from the pr pressure, we turn to return to Dhamma centers. But then we but then we find lots of things to do there. <laughs> Maybe more pressure. <laughs> and if you don't do well, the Lama say you have broken Samaya. <laughs> something something like this, but okay. So they also become 
a source of pressure. What we need to do with our practice is use it, use it, use it, use it to find inner peace, not outside peace. Inner peace. We can use our practice to make a place where our minds can be peaceful. So, our minds have a sanctuary, like a happy home. We have to make Because this reason, we have to make some time every day to let our mind relax. Maybe it's a good idea is to recite for 10 minutes. Recite? Rest. Rest. Oh, no reciting. Okay. Rest for 10, 20, 50, 30. Okay. Okay, 10 minutes every three hours. Oh, okay. Please, Sanya, that need to do it now. We must give a little bit of time to ourselves to, to rest. Please. <laughs> mm, sometimes. The name is Sane. Simply, the Chiru Yuliava, Toy and Yusan, or no such a go. I should just send Nando Kanando. So we also, you know, our mind is very distracted and it has to have some place to come in. Uh, like came back to home. Like coming to back camp. to home. Yeah. Uh, because if you are wondering, uh, many places or everywhere, then, you know, we need to find, we need to have a home to return to in order to re relax and rest. Today, you say, that the day you may send me a devour of your own chamber, send Karsuma, any other. Yashu Chunang yet to be seven days, you married in Alaria. Yashishuna ケミバレアチジドジャマトのネネチサムソムジョイユルトチモイネハムシャレスデレアカシウマディエロユリシェサレジジェンキャンドヤシネヤオスケミドアナウマゲオジオアレスタゲボデコネアゲボシャマシェ